Hi, I'm Hussam Dillah, Microsoft MVP. In this video, we will add pie charts to our Windows Phone and Windows 8 applications. We will use NuGet packages. For that, I'll go to Visual Studio and create a new project. Let's choose Windows 8.1 project. Click OK. In this project, in the main page here, I want to add the pie charts control to my user interface for that I go to the project right click and click uh, manage uh, NuGet uh, packages here we search for NuGet.org and let's browse for PyCharts.winrt, so that's the name of the NuGet package. PyCharts.winrt. So let's choose to install this package. Let's click install here. Okay. Now that the package is installed, it only adds. Um, a folder which contains the pie chart user control that contains the implementation of the pie chart that we will use in our application then contains a readme file that shows you how to use the extension so first of all here it tells you to copy and paste this code to your main page here so let's add this attribute then we add this uh, code to our XAML page. Let's build it. I click it Control Shift B, or you can do um, uh, Build Control Shift B. Okay. So now we see the control added to our application. So here for this control, I can customize it. For for example, I can change the percentage here for 30, for example. I can also change the radius. So for example, let's choose uh, 300. Okay, and then I can change the colors, the background for white, for example can change this one also let's say for example dark blue and this one also also we can change uh, the thickness so here from 30 to 20 for example Okay, uh, and alternatively, I can add this uh, text block to show, for example, uh, the value of the percentage of, for my for this um, pie chart. So this is the example that works for Windows 8.1 project. And we can also make it work for Windows Phone 8.1. For that, I'll go and create a new Windows Phone project. Click here, Windows Phone. Okay. For the Windows Phone project, I'll go right click and install the NuGet package another time here. So let's look for by charts.winrt it's actually the same um, the same uh, user control the same get package install okay then did the same thing add the new folder called cross pie charts contains the pie chart user control and the readme file I'll go through the same steps to add 
the pie charts control to my XAML page. So I add the XML MS using namespace. Then I go and add the user control A. And I click Control Shift B to build the solution. When it's finished building, then I can see here my um, uh, my pie chart control. I go and add this text block also to make it look nittier. So here it is, my pie charts that works for the Windows Phone um, application and also for my Windows 8 uh, application.